Hello and welcome to week 49. As you can tell behind me, there's a new location and a new sort of health regime going on here. And I'm going to talk you through a little bit in this video. So week 49, um, it is just going by incredibly quickly. So enjoy. My name is Mark and I'm here to help you live a better, healthier life. My goal is to help as many people as I can get into shape and improve their quality of life. Now, if this is your first time here and you want to learn more about practical and effective ways to improve your health and fitness, then start now by hitting the subscription button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos going forward. And now, without further ado, let's jump right in. So first off, I'm gonna start by saying, sorry, it's a little bit echoey in here. It is the best I've got at the moment. I'll work on doing something better over time. But for now, bear with me, please. It is probably worth it, but it's definitely worth it for me and hopefully for you too. In terms of what we've been doing, um, the normal format for these is accountability a week ahead. But I wanted to give you a little bit of an update first about what we've actually done. So we left the UK two and a half weeks ago now. Uh, we spent uh, a few days in quarantine in Jakarta. Uh, so five days in quarantine in Jakarta, uh, lots of PCR tests, um, and all of that went absolutely fine. The reason for a small gap in the actual videos is that uh, first time in 18 months, I actually had a holiday. So having come all the way to Indonesia, I'm gonna be working over here as well. It was one of those things where I thought to myself, I'm taking that first week off. I'm having a relax. I'm just gonna enjoy myself. I'm gonna make the most of the nice weather, as you can probably tell from the, the color of me. Um, it's a little bit sunny and a little bit warm, but it's been absolutely fantastic. As we were here a few years ago before COVID, and the people in Indonesia are unbelievably friendly. Um, except when traveling. When traveling, they become a little bit um, um, frantic, uh, which I suppose lots of people do. Uh, but that was an experience uh, getting on an internal flight uh, after being released from quarantine. So going from speaking to nobody and seeing nobody apart from the person who actually delivered the food and just put it at the door, uh, to seeing an airport uh, full of Indonesians uh, basically taking glorified buses uh, around Indonesia because it's so big, you know, planes are pretty much buses. So I don't know whether that was just me being in a little bit of culture shock or whether that's uh, um, the nation uh, traveling internally. But either way, we made it to an island called Lombok. Um, and then from there, we traveled uh, about an hour and a half in a car, then on a small boat journey. And uh, we are now on a stunningly beautiful uh, island called Gili Air. This is gonna be our base uh, of operations for the next um, three months or so. And it's just all came together perfectly at the end in terms of being able to work, uh, you know, work visas, um, but also having house sitters and dog sitters. Um, and for me, this is the start of a three month new journey, both travel and also exercise. So I mentioned briefly about what um, is gonna be happening, but I just wanted to talk a little bit more in detail now, and we're gonna resume the normal kind of routine next week. There is a gym on the island, it is open. I shall be going there when it opens in about 20 minutes. Um, I don't know about anybody else, but with me, bright sunshine means wake up early, and it's been absolutely lovely getting up early uh, and being able to do things uh, on the island. And the main form of exercise I'm gonna be doing here is going to be scuba diving. It is one of my big passions in life. It is one of those things that I absolutely enjoy. I find it so relaxing and peaceful, but it also burns quite a few calories. I think I saw some stats somewhere that about an hour of scuba diving burns about 500 calories. Um, if you're any good, it burns less. If you're not so good, it burns more, but you get the idea. 
it is one of those things that the intention is to do two or three dives in a day um, around work commitments and everything else with a few off days and on those off days uh, I will be going to the gym so today is a non-diving day uh, it was one of the uh, uh, the managers at the dive shop's birthday last night uh, so everybody had a great time or well, I think they had a great time we certainly did um, but today is non-diving because people are nursing hangovers um, so today is a gym day Apart from that, I'm going to share on the Thursday videos a little bit about uh, Indonesia, about uh, the island we're on, the people we're staying with, the food, and hopefully you'll enjoy both the fitness journey and also a little bit of a travel journey uh, over the next few months. I can't, I can't tell you how excited I am about the whole thing. Um, it is one of those things where um, if any editing uh, goes on, it will be uh, hopefully some images of what we've been doing, some of the people we've met. Um, even down to, this is gonna sound so daft, but I have ridden a bicycle for the first time in about 30 years. Yes, I've done a static bike in the gym. Yes, you know, that's fine. But that's not quite the same as trying to drive a bike. And when I say drive, I do mean pedal, pedal a bike. To say my balance, I've always known my balance was pretty shocking, but to say my balance was shocking is uh, now officially an understatement. Um, it's a great form of getting around the island. You get a little breeze as you're traveling rather than just be a sweaty mess by walking. Um, you are taking some more physical activity, so we cycle everywhere. But balance is a thing I need to work on. Just between us, my balance is shocking. No, no, it was shocking before. I've realized how bad it is. Um, so that is effectively, you know, the plans for the next three months. It's gonna be a work and holiday kind of combined, you know, business and pleasure and all that uh, good stuff. But I am determined to actually get on with the weight loss journey as well as enjoying some of the local culture. So we've had a great week off. We've eaten out, we've had some drinks, we have gone scuba diving, we've had a great time. Um, the plan for this next week is, because I'm back to work, is to actually start cooking at home more, start actually uh, doing more exercise, keeping up with the, the scuba diving. I do miss our dogs and dog walks, but there is a part of me at the sort of end of October that's thinking I don't miss the weather quite so much. Having to walk the mutts in rain, shine, snow and sleet uh, is one thing. Uh, you know, loading tanks of, uh, of air onto a boat and dropping off the side and going for a swim with the fish is um, very nice, um, very enjoyable, relaxing. In fact, it's downright awesome in between you and me and something I would recommend to anybody who actually you know likes water fish or even like my wife who hated all of that she's now addicted to scuba diving too so highly recommend it highly recommend Indonesia so far and I hope you enjoy this journey with us as we go forward if you enjoy this video please do smash the like button and I will see you in the next video